You know what, sometimes the things that us beer reviewers do, you know, we should get medals for. Boys and girls, welcome to another beer review. Um, we've got... We've got a beer, if you could call it a beer, um, given to me by um, Mr Gary Hunter. Thank you, sir. I don't know why I'm thanking you for giving me this. Because <laughs> I won't be thanking you afterwards, will I? <laughs> no, 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 let's let's be let's be kinda like um let's be sensible about this. After all, you know, people must drink this because they wouldn't brew it, would they, at the end of the day? So boys and girls, we have got Cause Light in the can. There you go. Oops. Mountains. That must dictate that it's when the mountains turn blue, it's as cold as the Rockies. There you go. I'll give her a spin. There you go. It is originally an American beer. Um, so I'll put this under me American beer playlist, even though it's brewed in the UK, somewhere in the UK. Um, Burn upon Trent, maybe from the Molson Coors Beer Company. So I've never had this before. Um, I did a bit of a search, like you do, on this. Um, rate beer. Um, very, I went on rate beer, stuck it in, and I think you know some of their scoring I'm being a bit critical of. In past reviews and that, but on rate beer, it scored it a zero out of a hundred overall, and two for its style. So, without further ado, let's pull the ring like we do. It says the world's most refreshing beer. Let's hope I'm suitably refreshed after this one, shall we? Well, I can just smell like a base malt. There's a malt there. That's it. Just malt, like a not an overpowering malt, just like a, a thin malt from the ring. So let's whack her in. I should use a plain glass for this. Because I've got a feeling this glass is too good for this type of beer. If you want to call it a beer. And there she's in. Very, very pale colour. It's 4%. Did I tell you it's 4%? Very pale. A cacophony of carbonation running up everywhere. It's an absolute mess of carbonation. The head is thin. The head reminds me of, say you got whipped whip cream in them squirty cans, which you used to spray on stuff. And if you left that so-called cream out of the squirty cans on whatever you're spraying, it will just completely suddenly dissolve. Say if you're doing it on a, I don't know, bowl of blancmange or something or a cake you square it all on and it just that's what's happening here with this head it's dissolving it's just going it's disappearing so there you go i don't know if you can see all that bubbles running up i've been kind so far i haven't really sworn either which is good because i might swear in a fucking minute so cheers Um, <laughs> for me, being kind, I'll be kind, I'll be constructive in my criticism of this one. 
for me, I think a, a pint of tap water might be a little bit more refreshing, if you know what I mean. I'll go in again. You just get a hint of maltness. It's very thin. You're not getting really anything else. You're not really getting nothing. Um, it's, it's, it's it's not. It's just it's just crap, really. <laughs> to be honest, in a nice way, it, it feels a bit crap. Um, it feels like first of all, first of all, I'm thinking, who buys this? Secondly, you know, do you really enjoy drinking this? Because it feels like it says refreshing. This is about as refreshing. It's about as refreshing as I don't know. Maybe you know, at the dentist and they're you know chopping away your feelings and your teeth and that, and you got all the blood in your mouth and you got the you know. The cup beside you, and you you drink it, and you swirl it round, and all the all the blood comes out and goes down the chute and everything. This is about as refreshing as that, really. Um, there's nothing going on with it, to be honest. There is really nothing to it, and that's just being kind to it. It's it's just nothing there. It's nothing there. Just fizzy water. Fizzy water. So there you go. <laughs> See you on the next one. <laughs>